Hi there. Um, back with another captured fairy jar. This is my large size. Um, this is the one that I charged forty dollars for. Uh, this one I made for a friend that lives in Colorado. Those are her three really pretty girls. Um, on this jar, I went ahead and used Wild Orchid Craft Flowers. My brain's not thinking today, I'm sorry. There's the tea lights on top. I painted those to blend in a little bit better than what they were. They were really white. Um, wild Orchid Craft Flowers on the side. My little homemade fairy dust. Um, the necklace charm that I put on this one is the fairy and the clock. Um, I embossed the tag. And, of course, on the reverse side, you know, it talks about the fairy. Fairies, sorry. Um, on the back, um, all I did was mix Maj Podge and Lindy's and Walnut um, ink and painted it on. Uh, she wanted it to be kind of a woodsy, natural look to it. And I think it turned out really, really pretty. I like it. Looks like a bark of wood. Nobody would know that was white tissue paper. Um, the trim on there um, I got from Hobby Lobby and, along with the ribbon. And put a little frog in the jar with them. Um, um, after I cut the girls out I went ahead and used uh, the stickles. Made them glittery like some fairies. Anyway, so this is the large jar. And I hope she likes it. Um, I, there was actually supposed to be four girls in there. And I thought that her littlest one in the front, I thought it was, I thought she gave me two pictures of the same little girl. So I didn't put her in there. Um, so I ended up having to make her another jar. Um, but I'll show those. So comment and let me know what you think. Be kind. <laughs> Thank you for watching.